Like it's now Saturday morning. Um, it's feeling good for a bite. Pressure's dropped, 1013, I think we are today. So it's good for a bottom bite. Spent a bit of time this morning. I've looked around a few swims. Didn't really see much signs of anything. Uh, so I've come on to what's considered peg one. So this is the corner peg. Well, it's almost like if you imagine that it's a peninsula that, com that comes out. And on the corner there's an overhanging tree. I've fished it before. So I've got uh, my left rod is under the overhanging tree and that's on a heist. Match the hatch wafter. Fished over the, the heist boilies, crumbed, bait soak. And I've got the heist pellets in there as well. The only thing I've not got on which I really would have liked is some particle hemp or sweet corn but at the minute I'm out. And then the right rod it's just off the uh, the reeds to the corner, and that's on me ever, ever faithful snowman rig with a high spot on bait, a glug's high spot on bait, and the uh, PLB pop up. So, just one more person's turned up, but there's only two of us on the lake at the minute, which is surprising for a Saturday morning. I'm surprised no one did the night as well. Like, I'm on the list for a, I'm on the waiting list for a night ticket, but. They're hard to get, but no one seems to be using them, which is a bit frustrating, but there you go. Anyway, rods are out, baits out. Any more updates? I'll let you know. Right, I've just had an idea. I'm just going to try something. Yeah, I don't have faith in bottom baits and wafters and uh, snowman rigs at all. Don't have faith in them at all. Nope, not one bit. Ah well, it was worth a try. <laughs>
not much happening at the minute. In general, it seems very quiet. Uh, I did see one fish show earlier across the other side. Um, I've had a couple of line bites. Redone, redone both rods. I've actually moved the left rod further out from the tree. I'm now in 10 foot of water. This is where the drop off goes. It goes down from 5 foot to 10 foot. I'm just on that drop off. Uh, yeah. Still here. I've got a couple of hours left yet. So there's still a chance something's going to happen. But I don't know. It is very quiet. But um, yeah, any more updates? I'll let you know. Right, well, it's come to the time where I'm going to pack up. Uh, going to start putting my baiting pole, pod away, everything like that. So it is actually looking like a blank. Realistically, the weather was looking bang on for a bite. I've just checked the weather app, and yeah, it's only from 3006 millibar. But just haven't seen really anything. I, I saw one show earlier, and that's it. Uh, a couple of bleeps, but nothing. Nothing more than that. So for today it's a blank, although I'm back Tuesday night after work, making the most while I can still get a couple of hours before it goes dark earlier as the winter draws in. So I will actually continue the video then and I'll uh, see you Tuesday. Tench. No. This is on that high flaster. What is that called? Yeah. I think not so. I've had one, it's only a small one, but at this stage I'm happy for anything, it's a lively little common, we're not going to weigh it. I'd say it's probably about £10, <laughs> can't even lift it up. Ten pound, ish, ish. But I'm not going to bother weighing it. But I'll take a couple of pictures now. Oh. Well, I've not got wet feet.
ways this one. And it went. It's a shame really. It's a nice fish. 13 and a half pound. But it has got a bit of a messed up mouth, but I suppose that's the problem with fishing. Uh, day tickets really. But yeah. Still very lively, so I'm gonna get it back. So, I've done the impossible and I've caught a second fish. This was 11 and 3 quarter pounds, but it's a beautiful little common. Massive head on it, dumpy little body. Yeah, there. Beautiful fish, absolute scale perfect. That's what 11 and 3 quarter pounds it was. Well, I'll take that. I've had two now, so I'm very, very happy. Get it back in the water. fish, third fish tonight, it's not the intended species but it is a stunning six pound tench, so that is a personal best tench and that was caught on them heist wafters, I don't know, I just can't seem to stop catching on them, they're doing absolutely brilliant, so let's get this fish put back and hope for some more carp. <laughs> 